The spicy fish taco recipe is so good, you won't want to save it just for Taco Tuesday. I've got fresh flounder here. I'm going to season this with a little fresh lime juice. And I'm going to create a nice spice blend using crushed red pepper. A couple tablespoons of chili powder, cumin. We're going to take a little salt. I'm going to stir this together. And now I'm going to sprinkle a little of this on my fish. You want to season both sides. Really make sure that you get it evenly seasoned. We're going to take the remainder of this and we're going to season our yellow cornmeal mixture. I'm going to take my wet hand, handle the fish with that, get the seasoned cornmeal mixture all on it there. Lightly shake. So I've got my fish nice and dredged. My oil is getting hot, 375 degrees. This fish is going to cook up quickly and stay nice and crispy. Just ease my fish down in there. You can, you can hear that sound immediately. That's when you know all the good stuff's happening. Now these flounder fillets are nice and thin. They're only going to take a few minutes to get perfectly crispy. Beautiful. Fish is nice and crispy. You want to let it drain just for a bit. Kind of let some of that oil sort of drip off of there. I'm going to rinse a little iceberg lettuce. The secret to making a good taco is you got to have some glue. Our glue in this part is going to be our guacamole. Very simply done, avocado, some lime, a little salt and pepper. I'm gonna take the fish, I'm just gonna break up pieces right on top of the tacos. Iceberg lettuce, a little crunch. Now it's just simple diced tomato. And I think the real star of this is gonna be this mango salsa here. We've taken the sweet mango, diced it up, uh, tossed in a little jalapeno, just a bit for some heat, some red onion, fresh cilantro, some olive oil, and then a very simple garnish of some fresh cilantro. So we have here our fresh, crispy, perfectly spicy tacos, not just for Taco Tuesday, but good for any night of the week.